everyone, thanks for checking out my channel, Dance Music Tutorials. In this video, we're going to take a quick look at uh, using the piano roll and making uh, adjustments to multiple notes, length, and um, different values as well. So, I'm just going to record a quick sequence. Right now so I need to make some changes to that um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, double click on the part and if you look at the, the notes here you can see that they're uh, they're different lengths different colors and you can see the the part where my finger accidentally hit another key as well so we'll take that out so what I want to do right now is I'm gonna select just select all the parts you can just do that by holding down your left mouse button and scrolling over. You can see when they're all selected because all the parts will turn black on the inside versus normally they're all just one solid color. So again, selecting them all is when they look black on the inside with the outside uh, line of the color of the box. So you can see that all the parts are selected. So what I want to do is I want to adjust um, all of the notes and how you can do this the quick way is just hold down your shift key and alt and then you can either stretch them or shrink them all at the same time so that's pretty cool because you know you have to go through and and set every everyone up uh, individually now in some cases you might want to have um, some notes longer than others so this wouldn't work in that in that particular scenario but for the most part um, I mean this is a, a, a quick little way of, uh, of, of adjusting your your note length and volume um, as well so if you look over here where it says vowel right here and you see they're all different lengths like you know 90 102 uh, 127 that's because I actually uh, pushed harder down on those keys uh, and obviously the harder you push on the key the, the louder it's going to be when it plays back but I want them all to be the same um, the same volume so I'm gonna just take my left mouse button hold it down and I'm using a trackball mouse um, I just scroll the, 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 um, the trackball down and you can see um, as I do that the color of the notes are changing so the lowest you can get obviously is one and the color is like a dark purple um, and then the loudest you can go is 127 um, and that'll be red bright red so and then you've got your middle colors um, so now if I play this back right so that's all the way down and that's all the way up so you can also do that over here Depends on what you want to do, you know. So 
another thing you can do is um, in the hyper editor, you can click on your pencil tool by holding down your right mouse button. Just everything for you. So anyway, so that's messing around with the Hyper Editor in Logic uh, Pro 9. Uh, we also took a look at the Piano Roll. And now if you go back and look at the Piano Roll, you can actually see here, there's a lot of other things going on. There's all this modulation. You can see modulation, modulation. And these are the modulation uh, uh, events that are occurring. Um, uh, you can see it's a pitch bend right here, right? So you can change the pitch bend now by just coming in here and s selecting it and then dragging your, uh, your mouse cursor down or up. Also, you can now mess around with the pan, right? So everything, everything can be uh, adjusted um, with, within, um, within Logic, which is pretty awesome. So anyway, so that'll conclude it for this, uh, this video. If you have any questions, uh, please let me know. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Stay tuned for more cool videos.